Hey guys, it's Nicola with your daily reads for July 24, 2018. These are general readings, guys. They may not resonate with everyone. Please check your sun, moon, and rising to make sure you're watching the right video. If you guys would like to book a personal session with me, you can hit me up on my email, intimatewisdomtarot at gmail.com. You can also check out my website, www.intimatewisdom.net to check out what other services I offer. If you guys want instant access to me, you can gain that through Instant Go. Type in www.instantgo.net dot com slash instant wisdom into your search bar to reach me you can also download that on your app store for my iphone ios users make sure you hit the red subscribe button on the side and make sure you hit the notification bell so you guys can get notified whenever i do my free reads other than that that's all i got enjoy your reads hey water signs it's nicola so we'll be doing this for july 24th what messages do we have cancer scorpio pisces sun moon and rising july 24th 2018 Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, Sun, Moon, and Rising, July 24th, 2018. Water signs. What y'all got going on? We got conflict within a household, conflict in a house, in a relationship, um, emotional. Someone's leaving a relationship. Going from the Ten of Cups to the Five of Cups, someone's leaving a relationship. They're they're moving forward. Um, there's some conflict though. Um, either someone's conflicted because someone's leaving, or they're conflicted about leaving. Someone may be expecting the worst, um, going through a lot of anxiety, a lot of crying, a lot of um, dramatic. I'm getting over the top dramatic. So someone could be very dramatic um, right now within a situation. Queen of Swords, either this is your doing, you making a decision that caused this type of uproar, or you are causing this with someone. So either you're I don't know. Whatever decision that you've made led to this whether it be good whether it be bad i'm not saying it's a bad decision but maybe your decision to look at a situation from a different perspective um be more sensible about your emotions maybe this cause this situation to unravel the way it is i i'm not actually picking up a break up but i am picking up conflict and someone leaving a situation um from the 10 to the 5, that's someone leaving a situation. And I got 10 swords across my layout. So that is definitely an ending. Um, five ones conflict and ending to, due to some conflict, maybe battling back and forth, arguing, maybe even fights. Because they're um, in this, they're conflicted. Okay, they are literally, and there's other people. So someone could have left a situation for someone else or someone could have left a situation due to another person. So let's see why this nine of swords is here. Why is this nine of swords here? Why is this nine of swords here? There's happiness in the in the in the crown and energy. So someone, there's some happiness somewhere. Someone felt manipulated, so they're they're withdrawing from a situation. Um Someone could have felt abandoned, alone, out in the cold. Like I said, we got a lot of fives here. So these are, you know, transformations. Stepping back from situations. Okay. Ten to the five. Someone stepped back from a situation. They're reevaluating whether or not either they want to stay in a situation or they maybe have already left. And it's just dealing with the aftermath or dealing with the, um, the heartache from leaving the situation. Okay. Why is this Queen of Swords here? Someone maybe needs to make a decision. It's like someone kind of laying. When I look at this Queen of Swords, she's just, yeah, she's putting it in. She's laying the, the she's laying her sword down. She's putting it into a situation, a relationship, a partnership, a job, whatever it is. This Queen of Swords here is putting an end to it. Um, Ace of Pentacles, she sees something new. She's no longer wanting to be trapped. Um, if this is not a woman, this can be a man ending a situation with a woman because he no longer wishes to be trapped in the relationship or the partnership or the woman ending it because she doesn't want to be trapped in the partnership. 
Let's see why this Ten of Pentacles. Let's see why this Ten of Cups is here. Why is this Ten of Cups here in the current energy? Someone's going toward a relationship. They may need a little confidence, need to nurture themselves a little bit. But there's a new opportunity for love here. Queen of Pentacles. So if this is a job, you guys were expecting the worst about leaving a job. You may have lost the job or um, been laid off or something like that. And you may be getting another opportunity. This is a relationship. You're leaving a relationship. And there's another opportunity after you've went through four of swords here. A period of healing. So today may, may be about healing past hurts, um, healing past disappointments, um, situations dealing with families. Okay. Why is this uh, Queen of Pentacles here? Yeah, you may not. If you were once in this situation, because I kind of believe the way this looks, it, it's a breakup. But it's the way it isn't sudden. So this, this, whatever this is, this has been long coming. This isn't something that happened all of a sudden. This is just something that's kind of making its way to an end or closing out. Um, with the Queen of Pentacles, you may be looking at a situation now from a different perspective. You may be looking at it today from a different perspective. Seeing that it's more practical for you to find your inner courage to give birth to your own dreams or your own or push towards your own love because whatever situation is this you there was no love here there was manipulation here um there was a feeling of betrayal being left out in the cold um and that someone sees it as more sensible to end that situation or to end that and call or go after what it is they desire with the moon card you're releasing the fears now you're no longer fearful of handling this because with the queen of pentacles she's also handling her foundation herself so someone's no longer in fear of starting new they're moving forward because this is this is something that they see more practical for them instead of continuing a heartbreak five of cups here why is this five of cups here heartbroken because someone wasn't mm. Someone wasn't giving you the attention that you desired. Someone wasn't giving you. Someone could have walked away from you. Could have walked away from a family. But ten of wands in reverse, six of uh, pentacles in reverse. Someone wasn't, someone wasn't giving you um, the energy or the attention. It wasn't a reciprocal give and take in the situation. Either from your side, or not a give and take emotionally, financially, um, support wise. Or on the other side, it was an imbalance, okay? So someone walked away. They, they went searching for something more meaningful, which caused anxiety within the situation, which caused someone to kind of be on edge. Um, very much in their head. Something changed, though. Someone may have walked toward a different situation. But whoever... Whoever... Someone doesn't see the error in their ways in the situation as well. So maybe the person being walked away from doesn't see why this is happening. Like they're still living in this in this illusion. So that may take them longer to understand or change their perspective and see the blessing behind this heartbreak. Because technically, from what I'm seeing, this situation will give birth to something greater for you. But the conflict is letting it go. Okay, so let's get some guidance. What messages do we have from our water signs? Here's the Scorpio Pisces. Cool. First one out, transformation. Okay, it says you're experiencing enormous change right now, which brings great blessings. Tucha. What other messages do we have from our water signs? Cancer Scorpio Pisces, July 24th, 2018. Sun, Moon, and Bowl. It says, unleash your adventurous side. Take a risk and be daring. Take a leap of faith. Take a risk. Put your heart's true desire into action. Like I said, some of you guys need to change your perspective and see that this situation, although it may be painful, is a blessing in disguise. Um, with fairness, it says the situation will be handled in a fair and just manner. That's all I got. Peace, y'all.